What is going on lads and welcome back to the channel. So just a weekly reminder that you can get your free player of the week from any of these players. You get a free spin if you complete the event that is there. It is the Spanish League event with your dream team. It is against the gay eye. So if you are a newcomer, if you've just downloaded the game and you're watching this video, welcome to the channel. And also this is very, very easy. You can do it every week. You don't even need to play the matches. We'll get into all the details in a second, but it's just a quick video to show you guys and you will be able to spin uh, for 100% for free for any of the players that you are seeing there. You will get one of these players on the screen guaranteed. So what you're going to want to do, as is the same with all these videos each week, you're going to go into the Dream Team events. Then you are going to go into events here, match Dream Team events. Once you get in here, you're going to want to go to the Spanish League. Now, mine is ticked. You will see I have already completed it. Uh, so, you know, yours, if you haven't completed it yet, it will just say, you know, do you want to enter? And then when you enter, it will obviously bring you to this screen here. Um, loading needs to be worked on a little bit, man. It's still very slow. But anyway, we get down and our main reward in here is going to be right at the bottom, which we can see. I've already unlocked it. But their main reward for this is a chance deal, which is basically a free spin. Uh, for the player of the week uh, that I showed you the players at the start. So all you're going to want to do is basically do your match settings. If you want to play the matches, you can. You can set whatever difficulty you wanted, but I would leave it at AI controlled. And as I said, if you take the difficulty up or down and you also have players that are with a little tick beside them, so they've got a player bonus, you will get more points per win, per draw or per loss. So it doesn't really matter whether you win, lose or draw. It'll obviously just take a lot lock. Uh, longer if you do lose games or draw games but when you go into the auto pick feature here you can just choose to focus on team play style and that will put all the players in that have um are not focused on team play style sorry if you choose focus on team play style or you don't really take heed of what players you're choosing you won't get the max amount of points so as you can see there with davies and goretzka in who don't have a tick beside their name we're getting a thousand points on this current setting when we go back out and we have every player that has a bonus, we get 1,095. So yeah, um, that is probably the best way of doing it is to just do the auto pick. And then, you know, I would usually pick Superstar if you've got a fairly good team and sim the game. You don't have to play it yourself. So we have just completed our last match. It took three matches. We drew the first two and then uh, won the second one, I think, um, where we we were uh, where we were simming the games. We weren't actually playing the games at all. So you just choose AI and uh, AI controlled. Once we go back out here, we will see that we have unlocked it and uh, it'll pop up event points acquired items added to inbox. And there is your worldwide September 29th worldwide event bonus reward, which is a free spin of the players that I already showed you there. So we're just going to go back out to the main menu and then we are going to go in to our eFootball dream inbox in dream team dream dream team dream dream team dream I don't even know what I'm saying we're going to go into our inbox in dream team here make sure you reclaim it or you claim it and then you will receive all of them after you've claimed that you can see that there's a little notification that pops up there with a one beside it and it also in the special player list there's a one beside that and when you go into this the icon will have changed to free so it won't be asking you for coins now we will spin the rest of these after we open the free one because we do want to get sun or graylish and hopefully we get him our kubo wouldn't be a bad shout either but there you can see it pops up it's not going to charge us anything there's no coins being taken from uh, if you have coins so if even if you have zero coins this free uh spin will work for you it'll just pop up free and then it will switch back after you've opened the free one it'll switch back to the coins so it's 100 coins so of course we do end up getting the goalkeeper it wouldn't be a, a, a pack opening for me if i didn't get a goalkeeper straight off the rip my luck has been shocking since i packed maldini and ronaldinho all those those months ago back in eFootball 2022 but hopefully uh i mean we did get makalele i think as well in fairness but um yeah i mean hopefully if we do spin here uh we would be hoping for sun even though i already have sun or Grealish, they look really really good and kubo looks quite tasty as well to play with but now you'll see that it has changed that it is no longer free it's no longer uh the free icon that pops up it's 100 coins so it's costing me 100 coins to open these 
and you get fr- three spins at it. So you can't keep opening these. You only get three spins at it. So you get your free one, gives you four, f- four spins. So you get one free one if you do the event that I have in this video here. And then you get three that you're able to do for 100 coins at a total of 300 coins to ha- have a shot at getting one of these players here. So you do give yourself an extra chance to get a free player um, and also a fairly beastly player. I think this player of the week, check out my review on it. It's not you know amazing this week if you don't get Sun, but we do end up getting Kubo, who looks like an absolute beast. He is a deep line forward, so I definitely will make room for him in a squad of mine and test him out and see what you guys think if you do have him as well. And last but not least, we have one final spin. But yeah, you can do this pretty much every week. Every time there's a worldwide event or there's a new uh, feature player and a new uh, event on the actual um, like events in Dream Team, you can actually do this and get a free spin more often than not. So I mean, if you do it every week, you're going to have a fairly decent squad uh, without putting a penny in, to be honest. Um, and then the rest is just optional. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. Hope this helps you out. Don't forget to subscribe. Peace.